Hello friends, welcome. In this video I'm going to install the React Router. So if you go to the reactrouter.com, go to the documentation and here we have the installation. And I'm going to install with npm. If you use yarn, you can add yarn here. So npm install react-router-dom at 6 because it's the version 6 right now. So copy that and I'm going in the VS code, open the terminal and paste that code in. Hit enter and it's going to install the React router. Now we need to import the browser router from React router DOM and we need to import in the index.js and add the browser router here. So let's go in the index.js, import that browser router and say browser router and paste the app there. So I'm going to mo move it up here, save, okay, close now the index.js. Next thing is in the app.js, we need to import the routes and route and also the link. Let's copy that and go to the app.js. And I'm going to add up here. Next, we say routes and we add a route here, the path when we, where we want to go. So in this case is the slash, which means the home page here. And the element is going to be the element is, we are going to render. So in this case, the home component. So let's copy that. And in our case, I'm going to do, I'm going to add after the search. And I'm going to say roads path when we go here now in this location, I want to display the movies. So instead of home like this, I'm going to say render movies. So render movies. Okay. And let's remove the render movies from here. Next. We need to create an about page. So I want to create an about component and paste it here. But for now, if I comment this one and it's save. And you, as you can see, if I refresh, everything's work correctly. Lion and doctor. So that's its point. To, the, to this road. So when we go to the slash road, so if I say when we go into the movies, render this one. So if I save, and as you can see, we don't have movies right here. We have only the H1 and the input. But if we navigate in the slash movies like this, now we have the movies and also if we search everything works because all the logic we make in the app.js okay so let's remove that for now and let's create the app the about component and i'm going to remove this one because it's for the class components so save that and inside the source folder, I'm going to create a new one and I'm going to say pages. And inside the pages folder, I'm going to create a new file and I'm going to name it about, about.jsx. Okay. And here let's create a function component. So I'm going to say const with name about is going to be equal to the function and inside here I'm going to 
return a div and inside the div I'm going to say just h1 uh, about page so now we don't need about page like this and we need to export default this one export default the about page so about like this save close this one and in the app.js we need to import that so let's say import about and we need to import that from pages slash about okay and i think we are good now here when we go to the about we render the about page so if i save and let's navigate now in the about hit enter and yeah here it is the about page okay this that's it the quick view for uh, react rotor how we can uh, install and how we can add a rotor roads to the react hope you understand fans and if you like don't forget to subscribe my channel like the video and see you in the next one all the best